Let's face it, living is better than not living. You know, I've studied a lot of movies, I've seen a lot of movie deaths, and you know what, I've come up with a list, a top ten list, according to movies, on ways to, on how to avoid death. It's a step-by-step -step process, okay? Just follow my ten steps, and I assure you, you shall not die of of causes other than old age. You know, I've done a lot of experiments. I've created a lot of algorithms, done some scientific notebooks, a lot of those, tedious as they are. I've come up with these rules, so please listen and learn. I am, uh, this is for your benefit. Number 10, imaginary friends. Stay away from them. Your little sister comes home, has an imaginary friend named Toby. Because me and Toby were having a little tea party. What, what harm can be done to me, right? Wrong! Toby! They're demon ghouls! Number nine, haunted showers. Stay away from them. There's a killer on the loose, and you're going to take a shower. Really, Einstein? You're going to shower now? <coughs> Just stop bathing. Stop stroking your hair. No conditioner, no shampoo, no body wash. If you want to live, just it don't it doesn't matter about hygiene right now when there's a demon ghoul on the loops. Number eight. <laughs> yeah, I just uh, stay away from kids in general. Number seven. Porcelain dolls. Stay away from porcelain dolls. You know what? Stay away from all kinds of dolls, especially porcelain. They were cute at one point, but now they're old and cracked and one of them has an eye missing. Just stay away from porcelain dolls. Number six. Stop taking vacations with your five best friends. Number five. Keyholes. Stop looking through them. Just, just why? Why do you keep looking through keyholes? Point to eye. We'll take out your eye. Your eyes will thank you if you stay away from those things. Number four, medical cabinets with mirrors. You know what? Mirrors in general. Just stay away from them at all costs to your personal hygiene. You're in the bathroom by yourself. Just me, myself, and myself. You're looking in the mirror, you look away for one second, you look back, what's there? What's there that wasn't a second ago? A demon ghoul! Number thrice, old creepy gas station employees. Stay away from those guys. You're passing through a small town, you have some car trouble. Maybe you just want to stop at a convenience store and get a peanut butter spilled Twix uh, cupcake thing. Whatever it may be. Point is that there are gas station people who are sometimes old, sometimes not. They're all related, all brothers, even the females are brothers somehow, and they will kill you. And they're all, they're all wet. They're all moist. I don't know where they're getting all this moisture, but they're creepy and sticky. And again, I'm straying from the point, which is stay away from them if you want to live. Get out of that town. Okay, fix your car someplace else. Number two, monsters, murderers, ghosts, demons. What do they all hate? Relationships, sexual encounters. If you have a significant other, you're dead. Hang down your head. Maybe you give your GF you know, a little smooch. Maybe, Hang down your head. Maybe you give her a rose. If you show any signs of affection and you're a teenager from ages 17 to 19, you will definitely, most likely, probably die. We weren't doing anything, we were just messing up. <laughs> Hang down your head. And now the moment I have been waiting for practically all day. Nine times out of ten, the number one way to avoid certain death. Get better cell phone service.
Hello? Cell phone service? Yes, I like to order ten of your best cell phone services, please, on the double. I'm going to a remote cabin in the woods. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.